Welcome back to Candy's Art World. I'm Candy, and today I'm going to be remaking a piece that I did in color pencils during the summer. Um, I'm going to be painting it with watercolor. It has a full bloom, a spent bloom, and a bud. I use Jane Davenport's um, palettes, a neutral and a bright. They're very nice little palettes. They give you a little card you can put... Um, color swatches on. I will link the palettes in the description. The link is an affiliate link and what that means it'll help me it'll give me a little something but it doesn't cost you anything extra if you click on that and order anything off Amazon it will not um, charge you any extra but it'll help me out and help support the channel. And these, these particular lilies, the petals alternate, so it looks like a starburst when you look at a full bloom face on. They're very cool flowers. A couple of tips with the watercolor. Um, you want to make sure that you are starting with your lighter colors first because you cannot really get the true color of the lighter color when you go over a darker color. Also, you can use the same brush like I did through this whole piece by simply um, using less pressure when you want a thin line and adding a little more pressure when you're trying to fill a bigger space or make a thicker line. Make sure you have a nice fresh cup of water to uh, clean your brush with. Um, have one for cleaning your brush and then another clean glass of water to use to mix with your paints. Um, you could also do like I do and have a little mist bottle so you spray your your palette and activates the it'll activate the paint for you so you don't have to work so hard to get color off of the little pans. And you can use a paper towel to, to lighten a color if you think it's a little too heavy. 